Hi Cancerians, so thank you guys so so much for clicking on this video and um, this is the first time that I'm doing sign specific readings so if this resonates with you please 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 let me know as this is the first time that I'm doing this and just need to let just let me know please. Um, also I'm doing a Easter sale, I have my 25 minute readings for £16 half price, they're normally £33 so if you'd like to get one of those then please email me or you can message me on Instagram. Cancerians, let's see what's going on for overall energy for Cancerians. So we have positive expectations, we have breaking free, honouring your true feelings, and peace of mind. Okay, so I feel like you guys are breaking free from some sort of situation. This could be emotional, this could be financial. So let's see what the overall emotion is for Cancerians for this month the rest of this month we've got time to collaborate so I feel like you guys could actually be going into a relationship very soon because this is my relationship card um this is sort of card that one of the relationship cards that are in this deck this one doesn't really come out very often so there's some sort of collaboration you're going to have I feel like you're going to be with somebody or you're going to find someone new and we also have helpful person. Someone wants to help you think of who that might be and initiate contact. So if you guys are struggling emotionally or financially, I feel like it's a good time for you guys to initiate contact with somebody, to let someone help you. Um, I feel like a lot of you are kind of backing off, kind of pushing someone away. So let, let someone come to you if they need to. If someone wants to offer you advice, then let them offer you advice. It might actually be helpful. We also have the sun in reverse. So is this actually a reversal? Because I don't normally do reversals. I like to ask if this is a reversal. Is it a reversal? It says this is a reversal for now. Okay, so while you are breaking free from this, I feel like old pattern, the sun card is going to be in reverse. But once you break free, it's going to be like, ah. Oh. So for now, it's like, make sure you're taking time to meditate. But it's going to be okay, basically. What, what they're saying is it's going to be okay. And to get help if you need it. Because I feel like a lot of you... Are going to need that extra help this could be in business as well we've also got the moon in reverse which i don't know why i'm getting so many reversals so the reversal of the moon means release of fear repressed emotions and inner confusion so you guys are really coming out of that the moon when it's actually upright is illusion fear anxieties and subconscious and intuition so you guys are actually coming out of a lot of stuff and this is to do with the breaking free aspect I don't, oh my god, this is, okay, what I got was, once you do this, once you, want, now that you're releasing all this fear, um, there's going to be a new person who's going to come in because you're realising your worth and you're honouring those true feelings that are actually going on. Wow, you guys have got some really good cards. This is really, really nice. Don't be scared of, I feel like, don't be scared of a new opportunity, don't be scared to branch out. Don't know why I'm saying that, but that's what I'm getting. That's just not to do with what I just said, this is just a general message that I got and also expect positive things to come out of this because it might be crappy right now it might be good but if it's crappy it's going to get better um even if it is good then you're already in the positive expectations so let's see what you guys got for love right so in the love section let's see what's what can cancerians expect for love in the next couple of weeks I feel like your love life could be moving a bit slow because I'm having a bit of trouble getting these cards out. So there could be something that's, that's being a bit slow at the moment. It could be someone slowly coming towards you or it could be slowly giving you information. So I'm not really too sure what that's about. You could also be awaiting news from somebody with what I'm getting. A text, a phone call. Wow, that came out really strongly. These are all your cards because I feel like, yes. Okay, so what's going to happen is, I feel like what they're saying is because these cards are just suddenly flown out, I feel like it's um it's gonna be something's gonna be slow at first to do with love and it's all just gonna come gushing out. So in a good way. <laughs> so we have soulmate religious factors. Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path. We also have new love, worth waiting for and retreat. So this is kind of like a mixed message. So let's see. So someone is worth waiting for. They, as I say, they could take a little bit more time. I'm not sure if you actually could meet them. In the next couple of weeks, you, you could, but I feel like some people are in a situation right now, Cancerians, where you're waiting on somebody who you know is your soulmate, um, and you're kind of letting spirituality help you in this sort of element. Um, this also could be a kind of clash in religious factors 
to do with somebody and this is causing you to retreat and to kind of think oh, what do I do but there is a new love coming and they're worth waiting for so if you're single there is somebody coming in for you um what's this what's this worth waiting for card please we have the nine of pentacles so i feel like you guys are enjoying being single at the moment or you're embracing the single life it's like i'm not in a relationship let's just embrace it and we also have the ten of cups so this is basically a difference in you your two statuses so we have the single life and we have the togetherness life so we have the single life and in a relationship life i feel like there's a strong line that's kind of going to be broken at some point um which could be basically as i say when you're kind of deciding what to do with this religious factors thing this could also just be in a sense that you're kind of deciding to do to be your authentic self should i be my my authentic self should i tell them about how i really feel about spirituality or my religion or how i t how i'm like an empathic person or a clairvoyant person this could be that sort of thing and it's also basically telling me that there's some sort of thing that needs to be nudged and i think this is to do with your emotions awakening your true self literally what i just said something needs to be nudged within your true self i feel like it's actually already happening it's just taking a bit of time so just be calm with yourself and i'm also getting deja vu which is a really weird time to get deja vu while doing a reading so i definitely feel like you guys could actually be meeting somebody who you've known before or feel like you've known before or it could be you could actually get deja vu with somebody as well or you could be getting deja vu as a sign that you're going to be meeting this person very very soon yeah i definitely feel like a message is coming through for you guys um there's a new love coming in just might take a little bit of time um but just focus on yourself because it's going to end up happening anyway it could actually be by the end of april and the end of may is what i'm getting um yeah I don't feel like there's somebody coming in for you very, very strongly. Can we have one more card from the Rider Waite Tarot deck? Oh, they're all flying out. Okay. Is this one? No. Okay, this is just one that I picked up. I'm just going to do that again. What's the overall energy for Cancerians in love? We have the Five of Pentacles. So it's also deciding whether to deal with people who have left you out in the cold. You could also be dealing with emotions from people who have left you out in the cold. You could be... Ugh, I'm getting like a gross energy so you could be revisiting people who have messed you around and it's kind of like don't go there don't don't go there um like an ex could be coming through or like past friendships who you really really don't like and you're like why are you coming through who the hell are you go away we have the ace of pentacles so i feel like you could be kept that was in reverse but i'm just going to put it up right i feel like a lot of you just make sure that you're giving yourself time not give yourself too much to other people and we've got the ace of cups why is this in reverse this isn't in reverse okay this isn't in reverse this is overall what's going to happen for you in your relationships it's all going to come together we've got the ace of cups it's beautiful so it's all going to come together just be patient and don't go back into your past guys don't do it it's not nice it's not safe it may feel safe but it's not safe that's what i'm getting it's gross it's gross gross energy uh yeah that's what i got that is what i got i need to sort out my reverse i don't know why some of these cards are in reverse i don't like getting cards in reverse because i feel like i can already read them without them being in reverse but there we go these cards come out for a reason what's happening in finances for cancers in the next couple of weeks please self-reliance environmental awareness and financial flow so basically what i feel like you guys need to do is if you're looking for jobs is rely on your intuition and how you actually feel in this moment and you're definitely going to be in a new environment at some point um it's also i feel like you guys might need to change up your environment so you might want to kind of change up your office or that sort of thing and we also have the chariots so there's someone coming in that's going to give you an offer of a job you could also be um out looking for a job and you could find one like i don't know while you're walking your dog or someone could offer you a job while you're walking your dog i don't know why that's kind of a thing or you could also be working outdoors in nature with animals but the finance is going to flow i feel like just keep honoring yourself and rely on yourself um for a job don't go to like job centers or don't ask too many people about what sort of job you should do don't, I can hear someone saying, what do you think I should do? I don't feel like that's a good thing to do. I feel like you actually need to focus on what you actually want because I feel like that's almost a distraction. Obviously do it if you feel like you need to. 
we've got the seven of pentacles so you are working hard at trying to find a job um you're also working hard at your job if you're not if you are in a job right now you're kind of reaping the rewards what's the overall energy for cancers We also have the Six of Pentacles. This was in reverse. So I feel like you could also be giving too much of yourself to others and not kind of getting it back. So I feel like maybe if you're looking for jobs, you could kind of be giving kind of too much of yourself or do you know what I mean? Like when you're kind of looking for jobs, you maybe look for too many jobs and then you kind of get overstimulated and like, oh my God, and kind of get like, ah. So it's almost like you need to kind of reel that back and kind of do what's actually balanced and what's kind of going to help you with a job. But apart from that, the money is going to flow in. and find a job that's really suited for you. So I really hope this helped. If this resonated for you, then please a comment down below, let me know, as this is the first time that I'm doing science specific readings and please subscribe down below if you would like to. All my information is down below for my half price readings and for my other two readings. And I will see you all very soon. Bye.